Hi friends, this is Devansh and in this video, I am going to tell you how you can fix this error process already running in Valorant. So this is a new method which I am going to explain in this video, uh, which is other than the, all the methods which is explained in the other videos, which is like to delete that file, DLL file. So if you find this video useful and this video help you, please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. So let's begin. So firstly, I will tell you the method. Uh, which is explained in most of the videos in which they are saying that you have to go to the C drive and go to the Riot games and in Riot client folder you have to search for the file name vc runtime140.dll so basically if you now go and try this file you will not get it even in go to Valorant and go to live and search for this file you will not able to find this file vc runtime140.dll it means that this method is not helpful anymore so now I'm going to tell you the next method or the new method which can be really help you to fix this error. For that you have to go to the playvalorant.com and here you have to again install the installer. For that click on play now and click on sign in. Give your sign in details of this account which you have created earlier. Now click on download. So it will again install the installer file which is of 65.8 MB file in your system. Just execute it again. And it will again ask for installing the 8.5 GB install. But when you install it, you will find that only 13.5 MB install is happening, which is basically the missing files or the new file uh, which need to be installed in your system. So just install it. And once you install these this thing it will start the game like this and here you can see the message will be appearing like verifying it means it will verifying the existing files in the system and once this verification will be done it will install the dependencies which are missing so let it verify and when is any dependencies missing it will install those dependencies in the system and you will get a message or a message like this installing dependencies now it will install once the installation is complete you will again check and try to play the game hopefully this error will get resolved so this is the method once this dependency will completely install you will get a message like this to play the game just now play the game and hopefully this time the error will not come so if you find this video useful please let me know and subscribe to this channel thank you